Welcome to Mobile World Congress Barcelona 2025. This is the home to all things tech and mobile connectivity in Europe and gives us a glimpse into the future of our lives. Every technology revolution from steam engines to digital has been the driving force of human progress. AI has been the word on everybody's lips for the past few years, but 2025 is set to be the year it goes beyond our mobile phones and computers and opens up our world to new ways to plan our lives and be creative. Technology boundaries will be expanded if we can do the following things. Reinvent traditional smartphone with AI. Revolutionize human device interaction and reinvent PCs, tablets, and the wearables with AI, achieving seamless connectivity. Everywhere you look this year, people are talking about agentic AI. That's when AI acts as an agent for us to perform a task from a simple prompt. So what we start seeing for the last two years is that the AI is becoming absolutely mandatory in all the mobile devices. There are a little things that are going to become more and more interesting in a sense that we're going to ease the work or reduce the number of clicks you start doing on your mobile phone. So I'm going to show you our AI agents and you can book a restaurant with just one sentence. I want to enjoy some local food nearby. Can you book me a restaurant for three people, 8 p.m. tonight? So right here we can see uh, the AI agent is, is handling the task and everything is automatic. So the only thing left for us to do is just to click a reserve button and it's all done. Brilliant. Uh, can I have a go? Can you book me a restaurant for five people at 8 p.m. today within a 15-minute drive from the conference center and with good vegetarian options? That's my dinner plan sorted. Let's see what it's like later on. Whilst Agentic AI is going to help us on our mobile phones, other types of AI are going to start appearing across all sorts of devices. Some manufacturers, like Honor, hope to open up connectivity to allow all devices, no matter the brand, to talk to each other. So I think for years we've all understood the value of open ecosystems, but that doesn't mean that in a lot of cases people haven't been locked into one, right? You see this in devices all the time, right? I bought a new tablet in part because I could get a tablet from the same maker as my smartphone. They worked well together. But when we broaden that ecosystem, I can get the best of the best innovation from multiple players and also potentially convince some people that maybe are outside my ecosystem to join mine. Now it's time to leave the Mobile World Congress ecosystem and see how the AI agent did with my dinner reservation.